Hi guys! I hope uh, all of you are doing good during this uh, COVID situation. So today, um, I'll be making one of the best uh, desserts in the Philippines, which is leche flan. Pero tayong brown sugar or light brown sugar, whichever is available. So gagamitin natin to para sa caramelized sauce ng leche flan. And then, of course, uh, we should have like a lanera or um, alternatively, kung walang lanera, uh, pwede kayong bumili ng gantong uh, lalagyan sa supermarket. So, this is around $2 uh, and Singapore dollars. So, this is around 70 pesos sa Pinas. And then next is uh, vanilla essence. So, later gagamitin natin to para pabangohin yung leche flan or more um, flavor. And then next one is condensed milk. So, pwede kayo gumamit ng uh, 392 grams or somewhere around 14 ounce. And then also, we need the uh, evap milk. So, pwede kayo gumamit ng um, one can of evap milk. So, this is around 390 grams. And lastly, ang pinaka-importante ingredient ng leche flan ay ang uh, 10 pieces ng egg. So, of course, uh, later, kailangan natin ihiwalay ang egg white at egg yolk. Kasi egg yolk lang yung gagamitin natin for leche flan. Hi guys! So, let's start uh, sa paggawa ng leche flan. So, una nating step is ihiwalay natin yung egg yolk from egg white. So, maraming techniques or maraming possible ways kung paano ihiwalay. Ang gagamitin ko ngayon is uh, meron akong sandok. So, gag gamit ng sandok, ihiwalay ko yung egg um, yolk sa egg white. Okay? Let's start! Okay, and gamit ang pinido, separate natin yung egg yolk. Okay, right, so after natin is separate yung uh, egg yolk from egg white, so simulan na natin i-mix yung ibang ingredient. So, ilipat natin yung uh, egg yolk sa mas malaking, uh, so ilipat na natin yung uh, egg yolk sa mas malaking ingredient para ma-mix natin siya with the other ingredients uh, like the contents at eva. Okay guys, so um, i-beat natin yung ano, egg yolk and then afterwards uh, i-mix natin yung condensed milk natin. So yung buong can, i-mix natin sa egg yolk. So just make sure na haluin yung mabuti para yung consistency ng leche flan natin is maging fine yung end result. Okay, so hindi natin yung isirang condensed milk. Alright, so after natin ilagay yung condensed milk, ilagay naman natin yung kebab. Kebab milk. So, isang candle siya. So, this is uh, 390 grams or 14 ounces. So, haluin na buti. Okay, 
Okay, so after natin i-mix yung um, egg yolk, evap, at condensed milk, maglagay naman tayo ng 1 teaspoon ng vanilla extract. So, kung gagamit kayo ng tablespoon, gawin yung uh, around sa lahat lang, more than half. And then, i-mix yung egg. Okay guys, so next step natin sa paggawa ng Dutch plan is uh, yung dianera o yung lalagyan na nagagamitin natin pang gulma ng Dutch plan is ilalagay natin sa stove or um, in my case, uh, nagamit ako ng infrared na lutuan. <laughs> Wala ako ng usual na stove. So let's add uh, one tablespoon ng granulated uh, brown sugar or white sugar. So make sure na yung apoy nyo is mababa lang para hindi masunod yung uh, sugar natin. So pwede kayo mag-add ng kompi pa sa yung brown sugar. So depende sa isang sa preference nyo. Okay. Para malis na yung uh, granulated sugar, brown sugar natin, pwede na natin ilagay yung leche flan mix natin. maglagay tayo ng uh, amount na proportion dun sa lalagyan natin. So, lalagyan ko lang siya ng kalahati ng mix na or more than half ng mix na ginawa natin. Okay, so papakuloan natin yung tubig sa pan and then once na kumulo na, mag-start ng kumulo yung uh, tubig sa pan, pwede na natin takpan yung saucepan. So, bigyan natin ng mga thir uh, around few minutes. Plus, uh, 30 minutes, so 30 to 35 minutes, uh, papatayin na natin yung lutuan. Tapos, makapunin uh, na natin yung light check lang natin. Alright guys, so um, after 30 to 35 minutes, so pwede na natin hanguin yung light check lang. And then, ang next step is uh, ilagay sa ref para lumamig yung lang sa So, see you later sa finish pa. Thank you for watching the video guys. And I hope na nagustuhan nyo yung video. Um, kung meron kayong suggestions or meron kayong gusto kong bituin uh, next time, uh, just let me know via Facebook. And uh, stay safe. God bless. Bye.